Hello everyone, this is Super Mario Sonic Cover of Super Key Pony Comms, along with... Hi, I'm Key Gaming. Yeah, and we're, this channel is going to be used to commentate over seasons 1 to 3 of My Little Pony Friendship is Magic. And how we're going to do this is um, we're going to have the audio... The, the video is going to be strictly just the au audio of, of our commentary. And then how you're going to see the episodes is... We're gonna put them in the in the description as a link, and as soon as I say three, two, one, go, that's when you'll um, start the episode on your end, and then we'll we'll just hang it, have it like that. So I'm gonna count down now. So well, just wait one second. What? Now, okay. Unless someone can tell us in the comments to get rid of the copyright, it's gonna be this way. Yeah, because we tried doing this earlier, and it just the video just got copyright blocked. Now this is going to be the first re pre-recorded message for mm -hmm. this video, particularly, but the next one's going to be scripted and professional. Mhm. Mm so I'm going to do the countdown now. So free, get the video ready, and three, two, one, now. Once upon a time, in the magical land of Equestria, there were two regal sisters who ruled together and created a No. <laughs> Wait, what time are you at? The eldest. Zero seventeen. But I'd just like to say, this might not record the video. It might not record the video's audio. Mate, I don't know, but it's not it's not supposed to, so Oh it, it, well the video if it doesn't catch the video audio that's fine because the viewers are gonna watch it for themselves. Yeah, and then there'd also be echo as well. Yeah. No I'm I really hate repeating myself because we did this earlier and like we said it got blocked, so we're gonna have to s repeat some of our points, so well, no, we did this yesterday night, so about yeah. 24 hours ago. Yeah, but basically, um, we explained how we became a brony, so uh, I guess we should repeat ourselves, even though I hate doing that. But, do you want to go first, or should I? Um, I'll go first. So basically, now we're just going to tell uh, you how us two became bronies. Mm-hmm. Now, I was tricked into it by my brother, and he is very anti-brony. So, oh god, the theme anyway. <laughs> yeah, I, this happened the same time last episode as well, so... But anyway, you can skip this, but if you skip it, you won't hear uh, us tell us your stories. Wait, what? No. Wait, what? I can't speak, by the way. <laughs> oh, but are you finished? Or what? I'm not finished. Anyway, I was tricked okay. to it by my brother saying there was a swear in, tr in the introduction. And long story short, there wasn't, and I watched it, and I kept watching it, and now I'm a mm -hmm. So, yeah, well, for me, um, I didn't really know much about it. I just saw... Like saw the title, I guess, and was like, uh, I don't really know what to think. I thought it was gonna be like a generic girly type show, and then I saw one of my friends, Xavier. Um, he did a commentary on the first, like this episode we're doing now, and then uh, I thought it was interesting. I wasn't really into it at the time. I was like, oh, you like you like this show, fair enough, and I just moved on with my life. And then, like really later on. Um, he started to show me trailers of Equestria Girls and stuff and just stuff related to the show and then I just decided to watch it when it came out and I, I surprisingly really enjoyed it and I wasn't expecting to and then I decided to watch the entire show and then that's how I really became a brony just pretty much by complete accident if you will and then um, it was only like four or so months ago just a little bit before the summer break yeah? Or is that your entire story? 
Yeah, that's pretty much it. Oh, okay. Aha! Elements of harmony. It was on the ray. Anyone that's read Fallout Equestria will get that joke. I have an is it a fanfic? Yeah, it's a long fanfic. Mm. There's a full I audio book version of it. I don't know if I'll be up for that because I don't like reading long fanfics. Well, it's basically My Little Little Pony and Fallout. Mm. And it's their vaults at stables. Uh. I might check it out, but I don't know if I will read all of it. Maybe if I'm bored. Hmm. Anyways. Me in a nutshell. Yep, that's usually what I end up writing. The mythical mirror in the moon is in fact Nightmare Moon. And she's about to return to Equestria and bring with her eternal night. Something yeah. about this terrible prophecy does not come true. I await your quick response. Your faithful student, Twilight Sparkle. Twilight Sparkle. Me in a nutshell again. Mm-hmm. Must say everything writing. Uh, whenever I read, I always say it in my head. Well, the thing is, I just randomly start reading and then stopping and start again. Mm, that happens to me sometimes. Mm. I don't know. Immediately would have worked. Until now. My dearest, most faithful student, Twilight, you know that I value your diligence and that I trust you completely. <laughs> but you simply must stop reading those dusty old books. <laughs> My dear Twilight, there is more to a young pony's life than studying. So I'm sending you supervised preparations for the summer sunset. I, I think we should mention the whole um porno thing. No. <laughs> okay, we'll mention it, but only because that's what we said and not the entire title. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> it's called My Little Porno Friendship with Benefits. It's a My Little Pony YouTube hoop by CS188. Yeah. <laughs> And that, that, was, that was the first thing you saw of this show, wasn't it? Yeah, it was the first thing I ever saw. Hmm. I'm a long-running fan of CS188, but his <laughs> recent work is sucking right now. I, ha- I haven't checked his recent work, but um, for me, I don't know what the first thing of the show I saw was, but the first pony poop I saw was Apple Bloom with Issues. Interesting. Something what rock have you been living under? I mean, if that's not interesting in the slightest. Mm. Hacks. <laughs> Hacks, yes. Because they all fall in the boxes. None of them roll out. Mm hmm. But yeah, this is Applejack, personally my favourite of the main six. Applejack is best side character. Wait, what? Lol. Yeah, apparently in the Brony community, Applejack is a side character. So how many times has that she saved Twilight's life? And how many times has she been like the main focus of an episode? Seriously. Lol. Someone just skyped me saying Space Marine. What? Because the orange family is too mainstream. 
Something tells me she likes apples. Yeah. <laughs> Just a bit. <sighs> yeah, this episode, the first episode is pretty much an introduction to the main six. Yep. It's one of the biggest major plot points, but it's fairly boring in comparison to everything else. Pretty much. Episode... Two is where stuff really starts to go down, like, get down, if you will. By the way, this is episode one and two. Mm -hmm. and the reason it's in low quality is because it's the best quality one I could find. Mm -hmm. Aside from being the only one. Hacks. Yes. More hacks. <laughs> uh, excuse me? <laughs> <laughs> Let me help you. <laughs> okay, I guess I overdid it. Um, uh, how about this? My stereo uh, packaging brain blow dry. Now, no, no, where's no, all the mud? Mm. Yeah, it just disappears. The mud is in her mane. So how she, her, and her coat. So how's she gonna clear it all that out? Mm. Well, I don't know. Well, this is a cartoon, so I don't think we should look too much into it. It doesn't. It doesn't make sense to begin with. If it was Pinkie Pie, I'd live with it. Yeah, yeah. That'll be a snack. Yeah. I'll do it in a jiffy, just as soon as I'm done practicing. Let's time it. Yep. Yep, ten seconds flat. Mm-hmm. Eleven ten to eleven twenty. Yeah, that's pretty cool actually. Twilight Sprinkle, her porn star name. Do people use smartphones to do sexy things? Oh god. <laughs> hey, I wonder what my brother's doing. Thank, thank the heavens that was censored. Yeah. Thank the heavens most of that video censored. <laughs> or not animated. You could, you could clearly see the thingy at the start of the video though. Yeah, but that's censoring in a nutshell. Mm. So long as it's pixelated, no one will know what it is. Yeah. Only the Sims can pixelate censor properly. Yeah. Well, it's a long story. I'm just here to check on the decorations and then I'll be out of your hair. Rarity, this is an English dub, not a French dub. Where are we going? I wonder if there's actually a French dub. It's a Japanese dub. And a German. Is it? Or... And an Italian dub. Green. Yeah. Mm. Oh, actually, I still think I saw a French dub of Equestria Girls. Oh, God. So, I wouldn't be surprised. Why do Cortex exist again? Cortex? No, not Cortex. Cortex. I have no idea. I was about to say, like, what, what has Cortex got to do with ponies? 
speaking of which, <laughs> um, yesterday we were going on, on like, um, DJ Art. Yeah, Art of, like, several different franchises ponified, and we found one for Crash. We found Crash Bandicoot, Neo Cortex, Rayman, Sonic, Shadow, uh, Eggman. Uh, what else? Did we find any others? We didn't find the Chicken Little Pony, but we did find the main six turned into chickens. And let's just say the Rayman Pony is just messed up. Yeah. But at least we found it. <laughs> I knew it was going to be weird, but I didn't expect that. Well, either his hooves were going to be missing, or his legs. And apparently mm -hmm. neither. Yeah. It would be kind of hard to do a Rayman pony either way. And without, this is without... still connected, when Rayman doesn't have a neck. It's just not done well, but it's done not creepy. Yeah. Yes, Fluttershy, we know you're Fluttershy. <laughs> Wait, your Fluttershy is your favourite, isn't it? No, Rainbow Dash. Oh, okay. Or Luna. Hmm. Well, it does the main six, anyway. Uh, Fluttershy and Rainbow Dash? Hmm. Yay. <laughs> yeah, I we been, we did that like all day yesterday and I always failed. Yeah, we were having a yay competition and I was winning. I I wouldn't say a competition, but we just kept on saying it. Yay. 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 <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, wow. Well, up until today. Do you wanna hear about today? No! It's called a time lapse. He's a baby dragon, not a cat. Uh, it reminds me of when I, when my cat was still in my house. Like, um, basically, he just came. He just can't wet, goes out all the time, and when he comes in, he just go ask for asks for food, and he just goes straight to bed. Yep. He had life sorted out. Yeah. <laughs> in food, sleep, out. Pretty much. And it, when you if you push him over when he's like sitting down, he'll just go straight to bed. <laughs> Literally, it's just what. These he was really lazy. <laughs> My cats sound more active. Hmm. My cats are actually the same age as me. Hmm. Pinky, shut up! We already know the script. Yeah. Why are you drinking hot sauce? She was, I guess she was probably. She was probably distracted by Pinky. She's probably ignoring Pinky. That too. Hot sauce. Mm. No. You just killed the party. Oh well. Uh, it's You're too young to be at that sort of party, Spike. And you hear Dobbs step in the background, I think. Yep. No, it's more drum and bass. Hmm. Much better than dubstep. I don't hate dubstep, but it's not good at the same time. Elephants. What? Elephants of harmony. <laughs> The stars will aim for us. Notice the stars moving. 
Uh, how does she not see that? I have no idea. I mean, Fluttershy maybe because she's colorblind. Hmm. Even then, you can still see the stars moving. Chuck Norris. Huh? Chuck Norris. Yeah. Chuck Norris <laughs> can top that. Billies and gentle courts, as mayor of Ponyville, it is my great pleasure to announce the beginning of the summer sub celebration. <laughs> Too many S's in the same <laughs> sentence. <laughs> Just like that one. Mm -hmm. The largest day of the year. And now. It is my great honor to introduce to you the ruler of our land, the very pony who gives us the sun and the moon each and every day, the good, the wise, the bringer of harmony to all of Equestria, Ready? Princess Celestia! <laughs> this can't be good. Lol, no, she went out to McPonies. Yeah, she went out to McApplejacks. <laughs> I just got a big, I just got a big apple jack for like nine uh, bits. <laughs> well, I would laugh. I would laugh if that was actually the case. You don't know. Nightmare. Hey, you don't actually know where she is at this point. She just appears at the end. It's been so. She might as well just be at Mac Apple Jacks or uh, something like that. Yeah. <laughs> Or maybe some pony. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Why? Am I not royal enough for you? Some guy's messaging me on Skype. Hey, um, Pokey Pokey. How about Queenie? No, Black Beauty, Black Beauty. Racist. Right yes. Does I no longer count now that I have been imprisoned for a thousand years? Did you not recall the legend? Did you not see the signs? I did, and I know. You're the mayor of the moon. Nightmare moon. <gasps> well, well, well. <laughs> Remember this day, little ponies, for it was your last. From this song and forth, the night will last forever. <laughs> okay, okay, where are you? Uh, twenty-one twenty-five. Okay. Start of the next episode. Right. I'm about there now. I just had to tell someone that I was recording. Owned. Yeah, we're gonna see that. Um, black magic thing, like throughout the whole episode. Lol. We gotta stop Nightmare! Or not? You've been up all night, No, she's a Harry. What's going on. No. no, she's a porn star. <laughs> That's her night job. <laughs> but we're not meant to know that. Only Pinky can know that. It's in the script. <laughs> I was surprised though that none of the main characters annoyed me. Hmm. It is said the last known location of the five elements was in the ancient castle of the royal pony sisters. It is located in what is now <laughs> the Everfree Forest. Why is the Everfree Forest so creepy? Let's go. Not so fast. Look, I appreciate. 
appreciate the offer. But I'd really rather do this on my own. No, I, I like how they, um, so like, <laughs> jump cut to the, uh, the entrance to the Evergreen Forest and just yell it, like, there. Yeah. It's called magic. Yeah. Thing is, they were in the library, and then because of Pinkie Pie, they were there. Pinkie Pie teleported them. Which doesn't make sense. It's Pinkie Pie! Yeah, true. Where's And that's why. Yeah. Because black magic. Hold on, I'm coming. I'm How did you flip? You were on your back a second ago. Really? Rainbow Dash Let's Go, Fluttershy apologizes. Fail. Remember kids, black magic is the answer to all your problems. Right next to Pinkie Pie. No Thrawn. Yeah. Still no Thrawn. The 60s cool. Yeah. <laughs> no, I keep getting the 60s and the 80s mixed up. Mm. Aren't you just shoving the Thrawn even further into your core? Yeah, probably. That's actually the first and last time she yells. So, except maybe um drag the except... fawn. Yeah, and then randomly the fawn appears. But oh, maybe you would count dragon shy. You know, if the black magic thing didn't actually happen, they, the elements of harmony probably wouldn't have worked. How did you know about the Maybe. Mm. You should keep that hair, though. Yeah, you look like a rock star. <laughs> <laughs> That's a weird fall. Could be right anyway. Oh, right. I think I've stepped in something. It's just mud. Oh, my God, a tree! It's going to kill you. Demon trees, run. Well, if you play Resident Evil, then it might kill you. And maybe Wispy Woods from Kirby, but yeah, he's easy. House of the Dead 3, maybe. This is the first of many songs in the series. And it gives me a headache. Lots of songs I don't like. Let's start counting. Number one. Mm. I generally like the songs though. I don't know. 
So some people like them, some people don't. I don't know. Hacks. Lol. Start swimming. What a world! What a world! Excuse me, sir. Why are you crying? Well, I don't know. I was just sitting here, minding my own business, when this tacky little cloud of purple smoke just whisked past me and tore half of my beloved mustache clean off. And now, I look simply hard. like the one of the few times reality has actually done something generous. Okay. Number one, that wouldn't hurt. Number two, why does she chop off her tail, which A makes her look so ugly, and B makes the moustache look worse. And number three, why doesn't she chop off the other half of the moustache? And then it'll yeah, and it out evenly later on. And then you could always go for the rock star look. Oh, Rarity, you're beautiful. Yeah, and, and how did he get knocked down? It's called being overdramatic. Yeah. I'm not even going to start to question the depth of that water. Because either ponies are Jesus, or he's actually feet through mud. Well, she hasn't. I'm not even going to start to argue this. Thank you for defying the laws of physics. How does fog cloud your voice? Uh, that's a good point. But I'm afraid you're 
Isn't yelling in the fog the best way of getting someone's attention to find your current location? Yeah. They, it might block your view a bit, but still. Mm. Six. Yeah, there's, you can clearly see six of them there. Five and the other one's behind it. Yeah. If not, what about that giant one in the middle? Yeah, so what, there's like seven? And like, no one, like, cared about that one. Maybe it's the element of chaos. Hmm. Because there can be no harmony without chaos. Bounces mm. it out. Or you could protect her. Hmm. Maybe it's, Maybe it would be Discord then. I don't know. Just a thought. Yeah, but Discord went a bit excessive with his power. He existed because he had to exist to keep the universe in balance. Yeah, it might, I don't know, it might, that might just be for decoration. This is my personal opinion. Mm hmm. Yeah. Yeah, now there's f only five. Like, what happened? No, I think the uh, five to carry them were just lazy and didn't fly back up to get the sixth one. So then it just randomly appears later on. Yep. Oh no, she teleports it. Oh. All oh, right. If you think about it, she teleports it without realizing. Hmm. That makes sense, I guess. They were too lazy to bring it. Mm. You little bone, thinking you could defeat me. Now you will never see your princess or your son. The night will last forever. <laughs> Moon, you must be getting tired after all that laughing. You're not mm. sounding quite like it. You can destroy the elephant. I... Apparently, Nightmare Moon is gonna appear again for season four, and you said that maybe Luna will get like. Maybe it's memory magic or something. So they're looking into Celestia's memory. Hmm. Luna's memory. Hmm. That'll be interesting. Derp face is derpy. Derp. Insanity. Mm -hmm. Somehow. Even though you've only done stuff like once or twice. I think Rarity's the probably the only one I can disagree on. Generosity exists because it helps with the Deus Ex Machina. <laughs> Alright, we've got the five numbers and here's the Thunderball! Pikachu, use Thunderbolt! I said Thunderbolt. I was making a lottery joke. Well, uh, I was gonna say that last time, but I, I stopped myself. Congratulations, you won! Here's your prize! You obtained Deus Ex Machina. Chase the rainbow, motherfucker! I like how they 
and perfectly um, redid that scene, that kind of scene with Equestria Girls. Sort of, but no. Well, it was the same kind of thing. Let's talk about Equestria Girls when we do it. True. That's probably that's not going to be for a while though, but yeah. True Fluttershy's colorblind. <laughs> Element of honesty. And then Celestia just comes out of nowhere. Like, oh, I'm back from Muck Applejacks or whatever. Yeah, I just got back from Subway. <laughs> I'll I'll laugh my head off. Wait, hang on. One sec. I saw the signs of nightmare moons. Three minutes. She could not understand. Wait, hang on. This is why we need we are recording. Do not disturb signs. Mm -hmm. Wait, what? This is why we need we're recording do not disturb signs. <laughs> but what, what was I saying anyway? Nothing actually. <laughs> oh no, yeah. uh, oh no, I would laugh my head off if Celestia came out back with like a Subway sandwich or something. Yeah, or a, or a McDonald's Happy Meal. <laughs> I'm loving it. No, I'm hating it. Burpee! Wow, Lula sure has matured fast. <laughs> My comparison, this episode and now, to season 2 episode 5. Hmm. Take a note, please. I, Princess Celestia, hereby... Tell me what you will, but the end of... The, my first time seeing this... Yeah, the end of this episode actually made me cry. Yeah. And my little dashy is a sad story. I saw an animation of it. Then you haven't seen a full animation of it. I'm still waiting for the My Little Dashy movie. Hmm. It is a good story, but only the end is sad. Hmm. And then you got the unofficial sequel. <laughs> so anyways, now it's My Little Pony Season 1 Introduction, Episodes 1 and 2 of Friendship is Magic. Yeah. We hope you enjoyed. Yeah, and we'll see you next time for episode 3, The Ticketmaster, I believe it is. Yep. Yeah, so we'll see you guys then. Hope you guys enjoyed. See you next time.